Of course, I was born there. Yeah. Um, we're talking with uh, Mildred Whalen now, and Mildred lives in North West Brook. And Mildred, you were born in Island Cove, weren't you? Yes, I was. And uh, what year was that? Uh, I was nine year old, and I'm 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 uh, seventy now. You're eighty eight. Eighty eight. Eighty eight now. I would be my birthday in February, but ninety nine. Eighty nine. Okay, so you're eighty eight. So you're born in uh, nineteen twenty six. Nineteen twenty six. And Frank was born in nineteen twenty one. Okay, your husband Frank. Your so, uh, husband's coming. In. Yeah. And uh, Mildred, your, your parents were William Smith and Sarah and Sarah Baker, was it? She was a Baker. Where yeah. was she from? Northwest Brook. She was from Northwest Brook. Yeah. Do you know who her parents were? Oh yes. Yeah. And Matt Callis Baker was her father. Macias. Yeah. Yeah. Baker. And Hannah. And Hannah Baker. Yeah. That was his wife. That was my grandmother and grandfather. Right. See? Right. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. And. Um, you lived in Arlington for a few years before your family moved away. Where um, did your family move to? Uh, uh, what family? When you left Arlington, when you left Arlington, where did you go? I come here. You came here, not was broke. Yeah, I come up here in boat. And your parents were here then. Came oh, here. Oh yes, oh yes. Mom and Dad was there. Yeah, and they came up and brought your family up from Arlington. Um, just oh yes, we, uh, we come up in a boat. Yeah. You couldn't come up in the car. No, no, that's right. Yeah. Now, when you were a little girl in Island Cove, what do you remember about Island Cove? Do you remember like about how many families were there? Were there very many people? I almost know so many was there. Yeah. Um, I'd say it's about thirty people. About thirty people. Yeah. Before you left. Small, small, small community. Yeah. They didn't, on, Skip. they didn't have a. They didn't have any stores there. No, no stores. No. Uh, you have to go. Uh, you used to have to go to the Labrador and, and go yeah. to St. John's and get things to carry to the Labrador. Okay. okay. Yeah. Yeah. Yay, I'm her. So. Uh, well, I said she must be did you, did you? Did you go to Long Beach then to get groceries or Hodges Cove anywhere then from Island Cove? No, they used to always go to Labrador. Oh. And bring it. Okay. Flour. I don't skip. Alright. Yeah. And they go to St. John's to get their goods? Oh, and go to St. John's. Okay. And Mr. Whalen, that's Frank's father, he used to make hoops to go around the barrels. You can remember that, can't you? Yeah, my father used to make. I used to cut them. Yes. Yeah. I used to cut them for the old man. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. And Island Cove, uh, they had a church there, a little church, didn't they? Was the church there? Oh, one? I would say it was yeah. church there. I can't remember very much about it. No. I mean, when you're kids, uh, 90 year older, you know, you, you can't remember everything. No, it's hard to remember things. Yeah, I guarantee it. Yeah. And uh, so your parents moved here to North West Brook with the family. And did they always live here then after that? Yeah. Yeah. They never went nowhere. No, just to not was broken. Is that because your your grandmother was from here, or your your mother was from here? Is that why they moved to not was broken? Oh, do you I think? don't know. No, I don't know. I don't. I can't. No, no. Uh, so you married Frank Whalen from Capelin Cove. Yeah. Yeah. And we lived in Capelin Cove for a while. Oh yeah. I don't know how old I was when I wanted to get out of it, but you couldn't get. Uh, you didn't have a car. No. No. Never had no use to have do uh, dogs and horses and... Yeah. Is that right, Skipper? That's right. That's and right. You were yeah. married... Of course he knows so much as I do. You were married in 1944. Yeah. And so you were married 70 years before Frank passed away. Yeah. Right. Yeah, I... Uh, the 20... 70 years was in uh, December. Mm. Because that's when we was married in December. Yeah. Forty four. Forty four. Yeah. Yeah. And uh oh was it January forty four you were married? January forty four. January, yeah. right. Now Frank was in the forestry, wasn't he? Yeah, well, yeah I, I, said, I didn't know that though. No. I wasn't going to look with Frank then. So you didn't meet him until after he came home? Yeah. Okay. Didn't know nothing about him. No. No. And did he tell you anything about the forestry, you know? Oh, just women. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he said he had a girlfriend, and uh, he had a girlfriend, 
and her mother would not let her go out. But he was going down on a bike then. This in Scotland? Yeah. 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 He was going down a bike. And she wouldn't let her daughter go up with Frank without her brother was with <laughs> Chaperon. Yeah, right. Yeah. 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 But anyway, that's that's what they have been telling me, you know. Yes. That's all I know about Frank. Yeah, and you said I, I didn't even know he was overseas until after. That's yeah. right. But did you say that he told you it was nine hundred of them went over from nine Newfoundland? Nine hundred. Nine hundred from yeah. Newfoundland. Yeah. And I'm, what was their pay? You were saying a dollar an hour. Yeah. I don't know. It was one, no, two dollars an hour, and he had to pay, and he had to send one to his uh, mother. Send a dollar home to his mother. Yeah. So he didn't have very much, did he? No. That's when he was overseas, up there. See in there? Yeah. yeah. And uh, when he came back, you got married right after he came back? Um, I don't know. Yeah. I don't know how long he was back. Yeah. I know she come from the Labrador when I met him. Okay. Yeah. And it was, he was fishing on the Labrador, was With his it? father. With his father. Yeah. Yeah. He's some young deer, isn't he? Oh, yes. Yeah, There's no trouble to get a bear with that. No, no sir. sir. <laughs> I guarantee. Yeah. Did you see him? That's his picture on the wall, yeah. is that? Okay. I'll just have a look now. That's our 50 over there. Mm -hmm. Over right over there with the pink so This is Frank yeah. Whalen, yeah. who served in the forestry during, That's during our 50. World War II. That's Sam um, Barry's wedding. Mm. Mm. Some young deer, isn't he? He is, isn't he? How old was he there? Do you know? No, I don't know. Don't know how old he was. Twenty, is it the most? Yeah. That picture was actually took overseas with another. What? That picture was took overseas. That one was. Yeah. 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 Oh, I don't know. He, I don't remember him telling me that. Yes, was taken when he was overseas. Yes. Yeah. She had a nice job working when, when she came. She was gone two months after Frank went. Yeah. Or three months or something. I'm mm. talking about Frank. Mm. And uh, your father, did you was your father a fisherman in yeah, Island Cove? He, he was yeah. overseas too. Yeah, your your father was overseas during yeah. World War One. Yeah. Yeah. Do you know anything that he about that or do you remember him telling you? I never talked too much about that. No. 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 So uh, you don't know if he was in the Navy or the Newfoundland? Navy. In the Navy. Okay. How was that? Yeah. Now Eugene told me to tell you whoever's taking that, that call him and he'll tell you a few things about dad if he wants it. Okay. That's your brother, right? That's Eugene. Yeah. yeah. My brother. Yeah. Yeah. I'm the oldest and he's the youngest. Okay. Yeah. Very good. Now, uh, when you came to live in North West Brook, were there as many houses here then as when you when you came here as there is now? Or do you know? Can't remember. Yeah. Old people. There's a lot of young people who, you know, grew up and married and everything now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And uh, Mildred, after a few years living in Cape Lincoln, you and Frank moved to St. John's, didn't you? No, we moved up here first. First up here? Yeah. Not and was then broke. we moved in 1960. Okay. No, that's when I got my license, though. Hmm. Um, I don't know, I can't forget now. They used to have to walk to Cape Cove, I know it's that. From, I don't know where, but they used to have to walk. They had a, <laughs> Mr. and Ms. Whalen had a serving girl, and Frank had to go and walk her down Cape Cove. <laughs> <laughs> you wait, Frank, that lady did die. Yeah. And she was to get tired, and they put the suitcase on the side of the road and sit down now. I know it's all that. <laughs> and um, but you moved to St. John's and ran a boarding house for a number of years? 1960. Yeah. You had a boarding house. Do you don't remember how many years you had a boarding house? It must, house? Be, must be 10, ten years. I yeah. ran the boarding house, 50 men. 50 men. And I worked at the Grace, too, Grace yeah. Hospital. At the same time? No. No. no, 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 good work, I see. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, I took old people. Yeah. That's that's the problem, I'm down old people. <laughs> so that was on Patrick Street, was that? That was on Patrick Street, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Then we built a new home in Mount Pearl. Mm. 
and uh, I run a daycare there. And what else did I do? Looked after all people there. He was a contrarious. Something like yourself today. Yeah, huh? something like myself today. <laughs> And uh, Frank ran a taxi business for quite a few years, didn't he? Um, must be seven years, I guess. Yeah. I'll tell you what it... That was a, like running a taxi, was that from St. John's to in around the bay in here? Right down to Royal Lorien. Right down to Southport. Yeah, right down yeah. to Southport. Yeah. And one day he took uh, five men, hmm. five women, and he came in and went down to Southport. When they got to St. John's, uh, she said, uh, he said, how come did you save the car? They all got up besides one. Frank told me that a dozen times. And uh, he said, uh, what did he say? Uh, I guess that's what he said. Oh, yes. He said, um, I, took, I, I took aboard five uh, ladies, and there's only four got up. Well, now she said, I got something to do. I haven't seen a thing, she said, for six months. Sure, he said, I'll tell you where you got to go, to in Imperial Optical. <laughs> <laughs> I can say, I can tell a lot of them old things. Mm. Yeah, he had lots of stories, I bet. Yeah. 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 Usually I had a case by. Yeah. Yeah. No trouble missing, I tell you. <laughs>